guys welcome back to my channel my lovely virgos so this is going to be your daily reading for your general energies and also for your love energies guys so let us see first what's coming up for your general energies before we move on to your love energies for today okay so for your general energies virgos what's actually coming up for your general energies We have the Ten of Pentacles, we have the Six of Cups, Eight of Swords, Three of Cups, Celebration, and Two of Pentacles. Okay, so you guys are like celebrating something. That vibe I'm getting is like kind of celebrating vibe. I also see with the Eight of Swords that you were hurt and you need a time off to celebrate some of you because you're deeply hurt some of you are deeply hurt with someone or someone hurt your feelings and you just want to put all those hurted energy aside you just want to throw all those hurted energy aside and you want to start fresh with a celebration okay or you want to just go partying or you just are like going to be doing that today okay you'll do whatever it takes for you to come out of that hurted energy okay guys that's what i see here for most of you virgos so you will be spending most of your time with your friends and family members. You are also like learning to balance life between whether it be your um, career and whether it be your personal life, whether it be your, whether you're, if you're a student and with your studying and with your personal life and all of that. Okay, Yet you are wanting to have a balance in life. That's a great energy that we're getting here. With this also, you're trying to have a balance again with a juggler but then you have to make a decision about two things and you will be making a decision also i see here okay this is a decision and a balance card with the ten of pentacles you're into like saving whatever you feel good or you're just doing whatever you feel good to do okay so you're just doing whatever you feel right about or you're just Doing whatever you feel like doing is right for you, okay? That's what I see for most of you guys. If you feel like something is going to give you the love and the, uh, what to say, and the feeling that you wanted, you will be doing that without any asking any questions about it. So that's what I see here for most of you guys, okay? So you're going to be giving love to people if they actually want love from you, okay? So that's your general vibe here i'm getting my lovely virgos so let's see what's coming up for your general i mean for your love energies right now so for your person's love energies also like how what's your person thinking about this connection right now what are they even feeling what are they even doing with their life love life are they like thinking about you still let's just find out virgos okay this person might be someone whoever you're thinking when you clicked onto this video. It's not whom I'm thinking, it's whom you're thinking, okay? So let's just see what's coming up, guys, for your person's energies first. We have the Ace of Wands in reverse, Page of Wands upright, the Tower card in reverse. Okay, so your person, like, your person and you had a great argument or fight recently so this is for a few of you recently but you had some kind of arguments and for your energies let me just take cards and then i'll explain to you okay and this card is going to be for clarification if we ever need any clarification and this is going to be for clarification if we ever need any clarification okay with these cards so with a page of wands i see here that you are doing whatever you like to do. You are being creative today. Or your person is being really creative today. They really feel like you are the creative one in their lives. They feel like without you, their life is kind of dull. And they feel like they cannot manifest anything without you. So your person feels you are there just like, I don't know, you are their magnet. They feel like, I don't know, 
they feel you are their magnet for manifestation. I don't know why. So, your person feels you are their magnet of manifestation. I don't know why I'm getting that. But your person definitely feels like you are the one person who is always there for them and if they want to manifest something into their lives they need you okay they're coming into that conclusion because the tower is in reverse the person is like was angry with you but right now they're okay they have uh, they're not much angry with you they're fine with however you are and they're fine with the situation you are in right now okay so let's see more your person is like coming out of the angry situation we have the strength card, we have the lovers, and we have the hierophant. So your person definitely feels like without you right now, they know now that you are that twin flame or soulmate, and without you, they feel weak. So your person feels weak without you. That's what I'm getting for your overall energy. Your person is not re ready to stay in a situation where you're not there with them, okay? That's what I'm getting, Virgos. Your person really wants you because they f they're becoming weak day by day without you. That's what I feel. Because with the Hierophant, this is a very spiritual card. So this person feels like you are a spiritual person and without you, they cannot manifest anything. You're just a magnet of manifestation for them, okay? They just feel that. Let's see for your energies right now. My lovely Virgos, what's coming up for your energies, guys? I see nine of pentacles i see the star i see the queen of cups here so you're just like also manifesting something you're like wanting to manifest you're gaining a lot of knowledge about a lot of situations so for the queen of cups you're just feeling like the situation is coming again and again and you are like kind of confused what to do about it okay you're also like, what to say, you're also very intuitive. So you're following your intuition, you're following your heart. You're doing whatever you feel guided by your instinct. Okay, that's what I see here. With this star, I also feel like you are like being very strong. You are like being very happy with the situation that you're dealing with. You're also like kind of confused about some things, but you're okay. You're having faith in this connection. You're just uh, getting inspiration from people around you, but you're going to be in this calm, still energy, having faith and also manifesting whatever you feel like doing and also maintaining a peace and harmony in your heart. Okay, so that's what you're doing, guys. Your person is kind of growing weaker and weaker. You're growing more spiritually stronger and stronger. And that is why this energy is like your person is kind of attracted to you because you're becoming more stronger day by day and your person is growing more weaker day by day. So your person is like, without you, I cannot do anything. So that's what your person is about to tell. So they want you to manifest anything in their lives. Even they want to manifest something little, they just need you guys, okay? It's just how it the how it's written in the destiny so we have the high priestess in reverse we have the five of pentacles and we have the magician so you guys are manifesting a lot of things you might be feeling a little drained catching on to your person's energy also but you guys are also kind of drained guys i'm not telling you are full strong and you're not trained you'll never be trained and all of that you are trained because your person you know like twin flame or soulmate connections you have a lot of uh, what to say similarities between you both even you both are connected spiritually and vibrationally so whatever this person's emotion is will affect you so that's what is happening you're manifesting a lot of things you're doing a lot of things for your own good your for you to become a spiritually higher person but i also see here while doing that you are losing your energies and you're becoming kind of drained and you're just like you are into this strained energy or so see here but you're going to be coming out of it so you're going to be in the strained energy because of your person and you're going to come into union because i see here you both balance each other's energy with this card here again with the main energy we have this person and you balancing together okay this card might also be in balancing so you both are like balancing each other in every way that's what i see here 
Virgos. So, thank you all so much for watching, guys. If you like this video, please give this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to comment down below if this video resonates, okay? So, this is all I have for you all, my lovely Virgos. Bye, guys. See you all tomorrow. Your lucky color for today is orange and your lucky crystal for today is opal. Bye, guys.